Hey, Sarah, sweetheart, what do you want to be when you grow up? A customer, business manager at Cincinnati Bell. In all seriousness, what my job has in common with what five-year-old me wanted to be, I always knew I wanted to be a helper, and that's what I am. Every day, I get the opportunity to help others, and that's something that I'm truly passionate about. Ending 2017, I have so much to reflect on. It was filled with milestones, both professionally and personally. I am lucky enough to have a job that not only makes helping customers, but helping the community a priority. This year, I helped with a bunch of volunteering events and found a new passion I didn't know existed. I helped organize adopt a class, planned dinner at the Boys and Girls Club for Thanksgiving, waddled a 5K for the Mini Heart, got covered in paint for our day in the community, and assisted with packet pickup for Walk Ahead. January through May was booked with doctor's appointments, playdates, basketball practices, Swollen feet, I mean the biggest feet I've ever seen on a human. And lots of naps. Fun fact, I found out Fiona and I weighed the same at one point. I continued my work supporting Daniel Purden, and I continued learning something new daily. Then May came and everything changed. <laughs> On Mother's Day, I could not have asked for a better gift. A sweet, chunky little man came into my life and opened my heart more than I could ever have imagined. I was so grateful that I had a job that offered me so much support and gave me the best thing ever. Four uninterrupted months to spend with my family, making so many memories. Got that sunshine in my pocket. Got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. In those four months, I did so many things I never thought I would do. I ziplined. I coached cross country for my daughter and 21 second to fifth graders. I learned how much 10 year old boys like talking about boogers and was challenged with learning how to motivate these amazing kids. My sister had her first baby, my nephew named Ellis. My best friend also had her first baby, a sweet little boy named Acton. We went to the gorge, to Kings Island, dance classes, recitals, gymnastics, swim lessons, and piano lessons. My daughter turned a whole five years old and started kindergarten. The reason I, I get out of bed every day and the people who undoubtedly make me who I am, my wonderful family. I came back to work in September and everything had changed. Good morning, it's my first day back from maternity leave. The company was restructured and I could have not asked for a better gig than the one I was put in. In this role, I'm not only busier, more challenged, but happier. About. I work for a great company have an amazing sales support team, support two wonderful people, and even greater, a boss who makes coming to work easy. At work, I would be nothing without the Melissas, the Alexes, Nicks, Marilyns, Steves, Jays, Matts, and Dons of this company. Every year, I wonder how the next will top it, and every year, I'm shocked by how much better it gets. Can't wait to see what 2018 has in store. Nothing I can see but you when you dance, dance.